And the rain came down in Dallas. But the Cowboys started off against the Saints like the sun was shining. Tight end Pettis Norman took off on an end reverse. With a fine block from number 53, Mike Conley, Norman carried inside the Saints' 10 before the referee ruled that he stepped out of bounds. They got their touchdown, however, two plays later when Don Perkins made it a quick 7-0 Dallas score. Gary Quazzo led the Saints in the first half, and they outpassed and outcaught the Cowboys. Dan Abramowitz showed how they did it. They outpassed and outcaught them, but the Saints offense just couldn't cross the goal line. After a fine 25-yarder to Ray Pogue, it was the New Orleans defense that set up the Saints' first score. Don Meredith did not play in this game, and between the rain and an alert Dave Witzel, quarterback Craig Morton had early problems. The Saints seven, the Cowboys seven. But Morton launched a drive at the close of the first half that set up the game's last touchdown. Number 32, Walt Garrison, carried a screen to the Saints 20. As the half ended, Morton found his favorite receiver, Lance Renzo, cutting into the end zone. As the third quarter began, it was 7 to 14, Dallas. The second half proved to be as frustrating as the weather for both teams. Walt Garrison's 85-yard kickoff return was called back by a penalty. The frustrations would continue until the final gun. When the Cowboys got the ball again, Dan Reeves, number 30, made back most of the yardage lost by the penalty. Second year halfback Walt Garrison sliced for 11 more. But the fortunes of Dallas were too good to be true. Maybe it was the rain that got in his eyes. Morton sighted a receiver and lofted a perfect strike to the wrong man. The Saints went on to kick a field goal and narrowed the score, 10 to 14, Dallas. And now the black clouds hung over the New Orleans Saints. Twice as they were about to score the go-ahead touchdown, fate and the quick Dallas Cowboys stopped them. The second came when Cornell Green intercepted in the end zone. Fate saved its cruelest blow for the last minute of the game. 
A Dan Reeves fumble gave the winless Saints a last second chance. Last week, Dallas beat the Washington Redskins in the last 10 seconds. This time, the Saints tried to turn the table. The score is 14-10, Dallas favor. The ball is on the Cowboys' six-yard line. There are seconds left. It's a hard way to win, but it's a harder way to lose. The muddy victory kept Dallas in the lead of the Capital Division and the Saints further behind.